Valley News Live at 6. I think there are perceptions that people believe things are changing and have changed, and they just aren't. North Dakota lawmakers are trying to bridge a wage gap between genders. Good evening, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us tonight. The bill will improve equal pay between men and women and also update the 50-year-old law. Valley News Team's Ashley Bishop investigates why, what this bill does and why some feel that it's essential to have it in this booming state. Equal pay policy in North Dakota since 1965. Nowadays, some people think the pay gap doesn't happen. What do they say on the paperwork? They say equal opportunity, equal pay. So how I feel is men are not getting paid more and women are not getting paid more. Other people disagree and say it's still an issue. Age old, it's, it's, it just, it's always been that way. I don't think it's changed. I know there's a lot of talk about changing it and trying to make it equal. I don't think it's happening. But according to the National Women's Law Center, the wage gap with men and women is still happening. According to the survey, in North Dakota, a full-time working woman makes only 70 cents for every dollar a man makes. Pay discrimination it exists and it is a problem, and we need tools to help address that problem. The North Dakota Women's Network strongly supports the bill and says it helps people understand the law. So that We have a two-year statute of limitations, but it never really clarified when that two years begins. Begins when the discrimination happens. And then there's additionally, you could file in district court before the law didn't really clear, say exactly where the filing can take case. If passed, this bill allows businesses to pay differently to the opposite sex if factors are involved, such as education, training, or experience. We reached out to the Fargo-Moorhead West Fargo Chamber to see where they stand on the issue. Their group has not discussed it yet. The Greater North Dakota, North Dakota Chamber President said they support the bill since it mainly updates a current law. The bill is still in the Senate committee and won't be voted on until next week. Stephanie? All right, Ashley, thank you. Another bill going through the Senate would also help address the wage gap and it would prohibit employers from firing or disciplining employees from discussing how much they get paid. A lawsuit may be 